do you know what are inside of your laptop if there was some issue do you know how to repair that today i am going to tear down my msi g62 7re gaming laptop this is my personal laptop i made it in this video using this one and i used this laptop at about 3 years Let's start tear down. First, you have to remove all screws in the back side. If your laptop has CD-ROM or DVD-ROM, you have to remove this nail and take out the ROM first. This is the DVD-ROM of the laptop. There are another 3 screws to remove. Now we can remove the cover. Please do it safely. When you are using screwdrivers or sharp tools, please keep in mind, there will be some possibility of damaging your motherboard. This is the inside of the MSI GE62-7RE laptop. Let's see what are these parts. These are front speakers. This is a 128GB M2 SSD. This is 1TB normal hard drive. This is 16GB RAM and there is another slot for a RAM. This is the base speaker but sound quality is very bad. These are cooling fans and these are copper heat pipes. GPU is under these pipes. This is NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1050Ti 4GB VGA. This fan only works when the NVIDIA GPU is active. This is the process of the laptop. It is under these pipes. This is i7 7 gen processor. So let's deassemble these parts. This is the CMOS battery, BIOS settings and date and time stored by using the power of this battery. First we will remove CMOS battery connector and then remove this speaker. Then we'll remove the battery of the laptop because there may be some current flow inside the laptop. This is a 6L battery and this one has 51 watt hour rating. Battery life is between 2 or 2.5 hours when we using the laptop. But when application uses NVIDIA VGA then the battery life reduces to at about 30 or 45 minutes. So let's remove the hard disk. Please do it safely because vibrations are not good for hard disk. In here I am using M2 SSD to store the operating system. You can also attach normal SSD by replacing the DVD ROM. M2 SSDs are faster than normal SSDs. This is the 16 GB RAM. This is the wireless card. There are wires of the Wi-Fi antenna that goes to the screen. This is the display ribbon. There is a small clip to lift in the display ribbon. And then we can remove display ribbon and Wi-Fi antenna wires. Yes. 
Let's remove this base speaker. And we can detach the motherboard by removing these screws. This is the connector of the fan. Actually removing this connector is not necessary. This is a separate board, we can disconnect it from here and there is a USB port and the card reader. This is the ribbon of the touchpad. There is power cable to remove under the fan. This is the back side of the motherboard. There was some issues with my keyboard, so I taped the ribbon. There are two clips to pull down to detach the keyboard ribbon and the LED ribbon. These are the connecting ports of LED lights and the keyboard. Ok, let's see the other parts of the laptop. This is the keyboard. Some keys of my keyboard were malfunctioned. So I ordered a keyboard from AliExpress, but it wasn't received yet because of Corona. The keyboard connected to the casing using small plastic tips. If I want to detach the keyboard, I have to melt down these plastic dots. I'm not doing it now because I have done it previously. I'll upload the keyboard replacing video after the keyboard is received. These are the hinge. This is the monitor ribbon and wireless antenna cables. This is the power connector. This is the touchpad and the ribbon. These are the parts of the laptop. Let's reassemble it.
I connected all of the parts. Let's connect the battery to the lap. Check whether if it is fitted correctly. Then insert the screws. Let's attach the ROM. This is screw for the ROM. So the laptop is reassembled, let's see if this works or not. You have to connect power to turn on the laptop for first time after deassemble it. Also it takes time to boot than a normal boot. So this is the way to deassemble MSI GE62 7RA laptop and reassemble it. I hope you enjoyed this video. You can try your own laptop to repair your own. Please subscribe our TechRiggy channel for more videos like this. See you on next video.